In this video, I'm charging a ultra capacitor module consisting of six series 2.7 volt ultra capacitors, each one rated for 400 farads. Um, here's the, circuit, the charging circuit. The flashing light that you see there indicates that it's charging. I'm measuring the voltage across the capacitors here. It's set to go to a maximum of 16 volts. And I've connected this unit to a single large monocrystalline solar panel. The open circuit voltage is greater than 21 volts. So, here we go. When it reaches 16 volts, it should be fully charged. And then we're going to test this to see what we can do with the fully charged module. It's nearing its maximum of 16 volts. The LEDs of the capacitors, the blue LEDs, have started to light, showing that it's maximally charged. At that point, I'm going to disconnect it. I don't want to push it up too high. So, um, the, the LED is getting pretty bright now. The charge rate is starting to slow down as it gets near to its maximum voltage. In fact, it stopped. So I'm going to disconnect it from the solar panel. This just took a few minutes to do. I've just collected the flyback, which is a push-pull flyback. As you can see here, to the fully charged unit, which is almost at 16 volts. And we're going to test it out, driving the flyback off the solar charged ultra capacitors. So um, here goes. Running pretty well. Nice output. Check my transistors for heating. I want to make sure that they're not overheating. They seem to be pretty good. They're a little warm, but they're not hot. I just connected it up to a CFL, i.e. the flyback driver. Let's have, see how that goes. So it lights that close to full brightness from my uh, ultra capacitors. I'm going to time this and see how long it goes. So here you have it. Still at 9 volts on the uh, unit after running the flyback for quite a bit of time. Let's run it some more. My voltage is starting to drop, as you can see there, across these ultra capacitors. Let's check the heating of the transistors. They seem to be fine. It's even running at 7.8 volts. Thanks for watching and please check back for more videos.